Hey guys, so I wanted to sit down and film this quick video. Um, yeah, my hair is a mess right now, but we gonna, we about to make it look real cute in a second. So today's video is how you get that cute, wet look. So we're gonna go from this to this. And with the wet look, your hair, you're not gonna walk around with your hair dripping wet. No, that's not gonna happen. The key to getting a wet look is to have the right products. The products I love to use are just regular conditioner and mix it with water and I have that right here. I used this conditioner, the Maui conditioner, and I love this conditioner because it smells really good. So I just put it in a spray bottle, mix it with water, and you can spritz it all over your hair. You might think, well then your hair is wet, you're gonna walk around with wet hair. If you let it dry, it dries, and it keeps that wet look. On top of it, you can spray some um, shine, sheen, really, make the curls pop and bring out the wet look. So you can spray this on your hair, let your hair dry, and then use some shine sheen, if that makes any sense. Shine sheen, shine, one second. So with the conditioner and water, I like to go in and put in this, or put on this heat protector. Go. Then I like to go in and put on this heat protector. It is the IC Fantasia heat protector. It is also a hair polisher. So that's what I really like about this stuff. So after you put, you spray the conditioner and water in your hair, just top it off with uh, some hair polisher or some hair sheen or something to make your hair shiny and let it dry and it will definitely leave you with that wet look. Another product that I love using is this Smooth and Shine Fine Botanical Oils and it has Camilla Oil and Shea Butter in it. And it is a curl defining mousse. So you can use a mousse on your hair to get that wet look. And like I said, you don't need it, but if you will, if you want, you can top it off with the um, hair polisher to really enhance the wet look. Another product I like to use is the Olive Miracle African Pride Leave-In Conditioner. This stuff smells great. It smells like mangoes or pineapples or something tropical. It smells so good. So pick you up this stuff, even if you don't want to use it as a, uh, to give it the wet look, to give yourself the wet look, you can use it on your hair to just condition it and keep it nice, healthy, and strong. This stuff is amazing, not only to give you the wet look, but to keep your hair nice and healthy. I love this stuff. Um, it says it helps stop breakage, split ends, dryness, repairs dry, damaged hair, feather light, moisturizing formula. So um, this is great if you want to do the wet look on your natural hair, definitely use this stuff. But I am doing the wet look on a lace front, so I like to put this stuff on my natural hair as well as it might be wasteful, but I like to also put it on my lace front to give it the wet look. And the last product I love to use is the Nairobi, I think I'm pronouncing it right. Um, I'm not sure. Wrap It Shine Foaming Lotion. Now this stuff is amazing. As you can see, I've been using it a lot. I love this stuff. Um, this stuff is also great if you're trying to lay your edges. Not only will it give you the perfect wet look, it is great for laying your edges. I can give y'all a tutorial on how I use this stuff to lay my edges. This stuff is amazing. Um, it's kind of expensive. It was $15. But it's, it's great stuff. So let's get started on how I achieve my wet look hairstyles. 
So what I'm gonna do is since I only have so much hair, I'm gonna do this side with the conditioner and water mix along with the heat protectant spray. I'm gonna top it off with that. And then on this side, I'm going to use the smooth and shine. I really love this stuff. You just put a generous amount, girl. Generous amount. Look at that. And just work that into your hair. As you can see, the wet look is coming through already. You don't even need uh, the this. You don't need any hair polish, any um, hair sheen. You don't need it with this product. This stuff is amazing. Work it on the ends of your hair and just scrunch it. Look at that. Don't forget to scrunch your hair to really make the curls pop. And there you have it. The wet look on this one side. Just like that. And it will stay looking like this all day. If, with this product, after you put in after you put this product in your hair, you do not need to reapply it. This, so if you can pick this up, pick this one up. But I also gave you other options as well, just in case you wanna try some other things out. All right, and for this side, for this side, I'm gonna use the conditioner and the water mix, and then I'm gonna to top it off with the hair polisher. So y'all can kind of see the difference between just conditioner and water and a hair polisher and then this one product right here. All right, and here's the wet look with the conditioner and the water. And if you wanna get some extra shine, just top that off with the heat spray. Sorry, let's call it the heat polisher. It is a heat protectant spray, but we're going to call it the hair polisher, not heat polisher. I'm confusing myself. Do y'all see that? Like, wow. Wow, wow. Look how shiny. Look how shiny it made it. So of course this side is a little wet. Ooh, so of course this side is actually wet but I'm gonna get my blow dryer and dry it. Or if you're not in a rush, you can just let it air dry and it will stay just like this. But since, um, for the sake of the video, I'm gonna go ahead and get the blow dryer and dry it so y'all can see that it will dry just like this. I'll be right back.
I'm just trying to show y'all that with this hair being dry, it still will keep its same lustrous, wet look. Being dry. Your hair does not have to be wet. Your hair shouldn't be wet to maintain the wet look. You just gotta use the right product. Ooh, I've been tossing it around. All right, y'all, so my hair is completely dry now. After spraying it with a um, conditioner and water mixed uh, spray bottle. All right, y'all, so my hair is completely dry now. And as you can see, it still kept the wet look even after blow drying it uh, completely dry. Y'all. I love this stuff. If you want to, you can even top it off. So, and look at that. Look at that shine. Look at that shine. Look at that shine. I think the conditioner is really what's helping it just keep that wet look. And then this stuff is really helping it keep that shine to create the wet look. Even though my hair is completely dry so there y'all have it, how to achieve the wet look without having wet hair. You don't wanna walk around with wet hair, especially in the winter time. So there you guys have it, the wet look using two different products, actually three. We used the Maui Moisturizer, and this together, the Maui Moisturizer, we mixed it with water, put it in a spray bottle. And then afterwards, we topped it off with this. And then on this side of my head, we just used the Smooth and Shine Fine Botanical Oils Curl Defining Mousse. And we put that on this side of my hair. So, which one do y'all like best? Can y'all tell a difference? Or no? I can't tell a difference. That's why I wanted to show y'all all the different products that y'all can use because you will get the exact same look. I guess it really depends on the hair and your hair type if you're trying to use your natural hair. Um, but from my experience, using all these different products, I got the exact same look. So, you have a choice, you have options. Go ahead and try everything out. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Please click the subscribe button wherever it may be. Please click the subscribe button if you enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up. And I hope to see y'all in another video. Um, let me know which video, what kind of videos y'all would like to see. If you want to see more hair videos, I can do that for you. Or if you would like to see more fashion videos, I can do that for you. Or if you want more advice and tip videos, I can do that for you. Just let a girl know. I love filming these videos for y'all and I, I really hope y'all enjoyed I really hope that y'all like watching me. I do have an Instagram if you would like to follow me on that. It is Danny Denise and I will put it right here on the screen for y'all. Um, so go follow me on Instagram and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I love y'all and I hope y'all have a great day or night whenever y'all are watching this. Bye! Oh, there we go. Hey y'all, so I'm back. Um, it's about an hour later because I forgot to mention to y'all where this hair is from. So this hair is actually the icy hair. As you can see, it kept the wet look very well. Like this is an hour later and my hair still has that wet look. So. But I just wanted to come on here and tell y'all where the hair is from. This is Icy Hair. Yes, yeah, so. All right. Bye, guys. <laughs>